Hey guys, and welcome back to the channel. Today we're gonna do something a little bit different. I'm back with my buddy C. Los. How's it going, guys? As always, and we're going to go over the Lego Voltron set. Wow. Now this did come out a while back. I know we're a little late on it, but I figured we can go over it and tell you what we think of it. So Silos, you purchased one of these too, didn't you? I did. So this is actually my sealed copy, but we're gonna show you what it looks like when it's all put together. And um, by the way, this is one of my favorite TV shows growing up as a kid. Uh, Voltron is one of the most iconic animated cartoons. It's considered anime still. I thought it was anime. It is Japanese animation. Exactly. And I have a lot of great memories watching it with my brother. And I can't wait to show you guys the final product. I believe the original was Go Lion mm -hmm. over in Japan. But when it did come to the United States, they changed it to Voltron, the Defender of the Universe. Loved it. One of my favorites from back then, like you said. Love the intro with Peter Cullen actually doing the voiceover for that. Uh, so let's go ahead and check this out. Now, just to show you the back of the box, it's cool the way it looks like it goes together, just like it did when they would transform into Voltron. Uh, the lightning bolts and everything as each part went together. And you know with the transformation, it would always like pump me up. Like yes. the excitement for Voltron to be saving the day. So Silas, do you remember what they would say when they would form Voltron? Uh, do you have an idea? Should I say it? I think you should, right guys? Activate interlock. Dino therms connected. Infra cells up. Mega thrusters are go. Let's, Let's go, go Voltron, Voltron Force. Force. <laughs> yeah, so then he would say, you know, form feet and legs, form arms and body, and Keith would always form the head. And wouldn't it be the movement like with the arms like this? Yes, the like crossed this? arms, the <laughs> arms, the legs, and then all together it was amazing. Such a good cartoon. Great memories, guys. So we're gonna go ahead and cut, and we're gonna show you what this thing looks like put together. I'm excited about it. All right, guys, so here we are with the fully constructed Lego uh, Voltron. I think it looks amazing. Like I said, I haven't unboxed mine, but uh, CeeLo's here did do his, so. This is my first Lego build in years. And I must admit, um, it took me three days, Billy, to complete. Mm -hmm. But as you can see, it moves. And it has a sword and a shield and the lions, the blue lion, the yellow lion, the red lion, the green lion, and the midsection is the black lion. Um, I just like the articulation that you could actually move. You wanna yeah. give it a try? You wanna move it around? Oh man, I'm, I'm afraid to touch this no thing. No worries, I could rebuild it again. No, I don't wanna move it too much. Okay. But I do think that is pretty cool. Yeah, so if you guys wanna see the, the body of Voltron behind. There's the backside, the guys. The backside, yep. So obviously the backside, you can see all the different pieces. I think you brought some instruction manuals yes. on how to put this together, correct? So it starts with the first book. You have to follow the numbers of each book. So it's the yellow lion, the blue lion. I like how they split them up. Uh-huh. The black lion and the red lion. And of course, the final transformation of the completion of Voltron. It was a joy to build. It's just some few examples of the lions of how they look individually. So that's pretty cool. You guess you could have the lions by themselves. Yes, you can. If yes, you, you wanted, can. If you wanted to. But to be honest with you guys, I'm afraid to take it apart because I may not remember how to place it back and I have to get yes, it back. Yes, that's always an issue with the Legos. Really? Yeah, because once they come apart, then you kind of got to go back through the book and try yeah, to rebuild that's, it again. That's true. You know, so. That's true. But uh, this is one of my favorite Lego sets that I own. And of course, as a reminder of our previous video that I also did the Nintendo Lego set. He did bring that one. That was already fully yes. put together. But this was amazing to do. And I hope that you guys liked it. I love it, dude. It really makes me want to put one together. Mm -hmm. So the last Lego I did was probably a Star Wars one. And that was a, a while back. But I do have some others. Guys, honestly, I have a lot more Legos that I'd love to do videos on, but I'm I'm gonna leave that up to you guys if you leave a comment below and tell me that these lego figures that we're bringing on are something that you would want to see mm -hmm. i could do some more that would be great yeah we could actually maybe do a uh, fast forward us putting it together and then the final view of what it looks like or we can do something like we're doing here mm -hmm. so voltron defender of the universe this is just a brief introduction of what the series was about 
These are just lovable characters. I remember Lance, I remember Pidge, I remember Princess Allura, Hunk, and Commander Key. It's a little history book, It right? does. It kind of mm -hmm. goes over everything. That's really, it really does. cool. You know, these are basically for huge fans like us. I was shocked that they were able to represent the Voltron series well with this Lego set. It's something I will never forget. It's worth buying if they're available. I'm not sure if they are or not. Yeah, if you're a big fan of Voltron, this is definitely a nice little piece to add to your collection for I any agree. Voltron fan. I agree. And while the price might seem kind of high, I mean, you have to think about the amount of Legos you're getting, putting it together. I know Legos are always pretty high priced, so. And, you know, owning the DVD series as well is just awesome to experience and to replay again. So, Celos, overall scale of 1 to 10 on a rating of this, your review. What would you say? I'll be honest, just doing a 360 with Voltron. I like that it does have articulation. That's pretty cool. It's sturdy, it's strong. Sorry guys, I'm just in awe of this wonderful Lego set. If I had a choice to pick a number, it's gonna be a 10. For me too. That might be biased because I am a huge Voltron fan as well. But look at it guys, what do you guys think? This is amazing. Yeah, let us know in the comments below if maybe this is something you guys might want to purchase or if you did purchase it. And then I guess let us know what you thought about it. I wish that we could be able to show individual online. It's a lot cooler. And I hope that you guys are able to like what we're showing right now. All right guys, and I guess we'll see you on the next one. Take Later. care guys.